Yeah, K1. Mm -hmm. All right, we're looking here at a uh, very mangled K1 uh, that NIST has uh, designated. Uh, the flange, it looks like uh, this part right here is the middle column. We can tell that because on the uh, inside of the flange here, there's only one piece. Whereas for the other ones, uh, it has four pieces on there. So this is from the middle column here. Uh, we're looking at the inside, we're looking from the inside of the building out. I'll be removing pieces from here for metallurgical analysis. This is a floor mounting flange on the spandrel on part K1. We're going to take a sample of it. Floor hangs below it. Okay, this is a part of the base metal for the box beam for K1. Okay, you have to yell. Hold on, we gotta figure out where to take it. I'm ready. Okay, this here is a part of N4. Uh, what we're gonna do is that this is the uh, middle column. We're able to tell from the back side, although we have no idea of the uh, height of it. I'm uh, going to remove a piece from the flange here uh, for the base material of the column as well as remove a piece of the uh, spandrel right here for uh, metallurgical analysis. This is N4. Today is April 11th, approximately 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Just those two. Talk a little louder. We're cutting on section K1. We are looking at a cut made on the lower outside. The bottom, the outside, the left hand column of a set of three columns. We're going to move over. Out. Now we're going to move over, looking along the bottom side of the set of beams to the center to the center column. This is the center column of K1, and we're looking at a cut on the lower outside of the middle of K1. Low one outside, ball one. 